Sometimes in life we are told what we should be and who we should become. And let's be honest, it kind of is annoying when we're told that we should do something that we don't want to do. We all live within society and so society does kind of teach us these examples of who we should become. And I want to cover some of these things so we can maybe address and kind of teach you maybe the correct answer of what you can actually be. Let's just jump straight into it. What are some things that society teaches us? Well, the very first thing is that you should go to school, okay? And maybe this is going to college, maybe this is going to public school, but you're always taught that you should go to school to learn and educate yourself. I think in one aspect, yes, it's important to learn, but I'm going to be honest with you. You don't have to go to college, okay? I know a lot of people who live in certain countries where college is unaffordable. They do not have the resources to pay for college, and that's okay. You do not have to go to college to be a good, perfect human being. You're not dumber than anyone else. You're just going on a different path, and that's totally okay. Another thing society teaches us is that we should be successful, okay? And what does this actually mean, okay? When you're told you should be successful, like you should have money, you should have friends, this doesn't make any sense, okay? In some days we wake up and we are not successful. We are not productive in this kind of day and that's totally okay. I understand we're all trying to push ourselves to be better versions, but let's be honest, sometimes we do fail. Failure is a huge part of life and in order to be successful, we have to fail sometimes. Failure also, yes, failure most of all. The greatest teacher Failure is. Lots of people really dwell on failure and that they're embarrassed that they have failed, but that's just a part of life. We're supposed to fail. So yeah, we do want to succeed. I mean, everyone wants to be in this kind of spectrum of life, but there are days we do not succeed and that's totally okay. At the end of the day, you're not always gonna be successful and that's fine. Another thing we're taught is we should be popular, okay? And I know a lot of people may not like this kind of aspect, like I don't wanna be popular and that's great then you're already on the right path but some people they really look at their phones and they're like okay I have to get this many followers because my music artist has this many so no it doesn't matter okay life is not about a popularity contest maybe when you were in elementary school and it was like oh I want to be with the cool kids like yeah that kind of environment kind of breeded that thought process but now in life it doesn't matter if you're happy with the couple of friends that you have then that's all that matters. You do not have to be a popular person. You do not have to make everyone in your life like you and appreciate you for who you are. There are gonna be people who dislike you. As a matter of fact, there are probably gonna be dislikes on this video. Being popular is not something that you should aspire to be. Maybe it just comes with what you're doing in life, but being popular is not important. And if you're popular, there's so many other things you have to deal with. People recognizing you. You're always having to put on a good image for everyone so that people don't think you're mean to them. So it's not a nightmare if at the end of the day, people don't recognize you. This is something that really annoys me. We're supposed to look a certain way. You can see with modeling and how people dress, and how it's promoted on billboards and advertisements and on our phones that maybe we should look this certain way. But to be honest with you, this is just a bunch of hocus pocus. We as humans are different. We have different skin colors. We have different facial features. Our bodies are different shapes, okay? And that's fine. That does not mean you're supposed to look a certain way. Yes, we are brainwashed to try and be taught that we should look this way, but that's totally wrong. Sometimes physically we cannot look these ways. Most of these photos are edited. These models wear enormous amounts of makeup and it puts this false reality that we're supposed to look this way. It's not true. And people get stuck in this trap where they look in the mirror and they get upset with how they look because they don't look like these people that they see online all the time. Social media is fake. The more you remember that and keep reminding yourself, then you will not fall into this trap of wanting to look a certain way. Be yourself and be happy for who you are. We have our flaws for how we look. Like, I don't even have perfect straight teeth, okay? But it's just something that I live with and that's fine. If you understand that we as humans all have flaws and accept them, then you're already in a better place to know that looking a certain way isn't the way you should be living. The last thing I want to talk about is perfectionism, okay? I don't even know if I spelled this word right, but we're just gonna roll with it. Perfectionism is the way of making or creating something and it's supposed to be perfect. Sometimes in life when we create something or we do a project, it won't end up being 
perfect in our brains. We always see the little flaws. We always see the, oh, it could be edited and tweaked in this kind of way. But in all honesty, we are not perfect as humans. I'm not perfect. You're not perfect. Nobody is perfect. We all make mistakes. We all are impatient sometimes. We all get tired. Everything affects us. And in a way, it's hard to create stuff that is purely perfect because we are not made to be this way. I think the biggest thing about going towards perfectionism is that we learn from our past mistakes. We strive to be good. Yes, we strive to be amazing, but sometimes we just cannot get there. And sometimes it's just not possible. Maybe, yeah, you can be popular within your life. And maybe, yes, you've gone to school, but there are other things on this list that just aren't achievable in your life. And I'm here to say, that's okay. Society will teach you to live and be a certain way. These reminders are always going to be not on your door whether they're advertisements or what other people say don't let these thoughts come into your head I'm gonna end this video with this quote right here I think it's perfect that yes these thoughts do come out but we should allow them to just leave our brain make sure the exit is right there and you can point for them to head out thanks guys for watching this video stay hydrated I'll see you in the next video